Hello everybody, and today I'm going to be talking about the situation with Tame Master. Now, of course, I have made a video on this already, but I really wanted to make an update video because it has gone way out of date. And since then, there has been so much new information that came out, and I really wanted to tell you guys what happened so you guys don't watch my other video and not know what's going on. So make sure you guys go ahead and like the video so more people can know about this, and comment your opinion down below of who do you think is right and who you think is wrong, and all this information that I'm going to cover later, you can also give your stance on that inside of the comment section. Because I really want to know what you guys think and if you guys have any new information that i don't already know also leave that in the comments below and also like i said before like the video so more people can see it and can also know this information and we could just share around the information so everybody knows that hey tame master was apparently lying because this was kind of a little bit too much to fit in just one comment plus i have a ton of screenshots that i need to show you to update the situation so of course for people who are new i'm gonna go ahead and explain it but before i do i want to go ahead and say why i'm making this video because last time i made this video i got a ton of criticism and and hate if you want to call it that but the reason I'm making this video is not for monetary gain etc the reason I'm making this video is of course to explain the situation and say what I think about it and of course provide information for people who have no idea what it is or correct people who have been misinformed so now that I explained what I'm doing I'm gonna go ahead and start the situation so a brief explanation of what just happened in the past with the situation is Tay Master posted this tweet and this tweet of course started it all and basically what the tweet was saying is my wife pixelated candy, cleaned out her bank account, plans on taking her house, left me with nothing but $138, and my car to drive home to Canada. If evil exists, it's these like this that really breaks a man. I don't know what to do anymore. So after this, people were supporting him and automatically calling his wife pixelated candy, an uh, idiot, and everything imaginable. That's bad. And really, it's really sad how people automatically assume that she was in the wrong. Of course, my video, I did put her in sort of a bad light, but that's just because a ton of stuff was going against her but now we found out that none of that is true or we don't really know if none of that is true what we do know is a lot of it probably isn't true but of course i do have some theories about this and i will be getting on to that later but for right now pixie actually made an entire statement about this and discussed a lot of the concerns that we had with her entire situation and team master also put some stuff on discord that i also want to talk about so let's go ahead and get this started so as you know if you've been keeping up with the situation for a short period of time team masters and pixie's account were both both deactivated however they are both reactivated now and tame master said on discord my twitter was deleted without consent probably will never get it back any twitter accounts impersonating me are obviously not me now he got his twitter account back but as you can see he said my twitter was deleted without consent so who deleted his twitter obviously a hacker didn't delete his twitter account because then he would say my twitter was hacked and deleted but instead he said it was deleted without consent which means somebody who had his password deleted his twitter account or deactivated in this case. So, does that mean that Pixelated deleted his Twitter account or deactivated it? I have no idea. However, that is a complete possibility. Now, of course, Tay Master did post some other stuff on the Discord, and of course, this was all in the Mad City Discord. I'll leave it down below inside the description if you do want to join it. However, I don't think he's going to be making any statements on there, but he might make some new ones, so I will keep you updated, and you can join the Discord if you want. So, of course, his last statement on Discord was saying, I was able to recover my Twitter. Currently, all tweets post in the past on my account are for me. Moving forward, I'm going to make sure my family is safe, so please do not send hate to any of my family, including pigs. There's a lot we need to figure out, but this shouldn't have been a public matter. Sorry for everything. Now, of course, he clarified that every single tweet that he made instead of the past on his account currently was made by him, which is kind of ironic because the only tweet left over from that entire thing is the tweet saying, shut up, beism. Now, of course, I can't stress this enough. Do not send hate to any party involved or any people that aren't involved of course you can give them criticism etc but do not just send hate and threats and stuff for no reason so of course tame master's statement on discord does actually continue and this is where it really gets confusing so he says to clarify she did not steal her money she did not leave me with nothing everything is fine now here's where i'm actually confused and actually wondering what's going on so as you can see he denies all claims of what he said before where he said that she stole his money and left them only with 138 dollars so my question is where did you get this information from and did you just pull this out of thin air and if so why and how is this even possible because who in their right mind would just pull this out of thin air for no reason it seemed like everything is perfectly fine so i have no idea where he got this 138 dollars from etc and apparently none of it was true so something's not adding up here i don't know if what's going on but i know that it doesn't really make sense for you to just lie about your wife for no reason when literally none of it was true or at least you say that none 
kind of is true. In my opinion, I think that there is a possibility, this is not 100%, but there is a possibility that they could have just solved it and not wanted to damage Pixelated's reputation, just decided to say that it was all fake when it actually wasn't. Now, of course, take that with a grain of salt because that's just a theory. Now, after Team Master said that on his Discord, Pixelated actually did post an entire statement of her own on Twitter. So, she said, I love how quick people were to attack me during a horrible time in my marriage. People even as prominent as Bism, but now that Taylor took it to his Discord to announce that it wasn't true, no one questions his lies against me, nor has apologized for their cruelty. And obviously, I am questioning his lies against you because now that he's admitted that it wasn't true, I'm questioning that why would he do this? What is the intention behind him saying all this stuff that apparently isn't true? Now, of course, people who immediately thought that Pixelated was bad and immediately sent her hate messages and threats should, of course, apologize, and that was really bad of them to do, and I highly suggest you do not do that because that is really bad and this is also a human so you should obviously give her a chance now of course she did reply to Dieter plays and all these people accusing her of being a predator of course and Scrimmix actually is the one who initiated this but he actually got it wrong because he said Beism stated that you married him whilst he was underage which obviously is not possible I don't think unless like some stuff happens but usually people don't do that so I don't understand why he did that when Beism did not say that Beism said that she pursued him while he was underage, which is honestly kind of dumb because it's not like he was like five. He was like 17 and apparently he wasn't even 17. Apparently he was 19 according to Pixelated, but even if he was 17, I feel like that should still be okay. Now the proof that Scrimmage gave that this was true is that they dated seven years ago. However, she did use the excuse that it was a typo and actually that's not true. So really, we don't really know any information on this and we can't really come to a conclusion on that and it's best to assume that they didn't do that because obviously the only person who has proof is Beism and she really hasn't released much so I have no idea. Now as you know if you watch my other video people accused her of stealing code from Royal High and putting it into her own game so of course she replied to that also and she said that's just fake news with fake edited images. Someone tried to pass it off as true but when I post the unedited images took down the call. It was funny to be honest. Now of course she didn't post any of the unedited images so we have no idea if she's telling the truth or not, but until we see the proof, we can't really say if she did it or she didn't do it. So of course, that's really going to be the end of the video. Make sure you guys comment down below what you guys think about this, and of course, make sure you guys tell me if you have any more information like I said at the beginning of the video, and like the video so more people can know about this and know that Team Master is lying, like I said before. And of course, I hope this video cleared up some stuff if you did not know it, and yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Like the video, subscribe for more, turn notifications and follow me on Twitter so you know about these things instantly and do my discord down below because that's the best way to contact me and goodbye got my eyes on a computer screen trying to work my digits in i fidget with my lettering but never with my sentences i pause and check the clock and it appears at 6 a.m again another night wasted or another day finished and my mind is steady running in place i don't want to fall asleep because i got so much to say but i don't want to stay awake and keep exhaustion